If you become a World War II reenactor or any type of military reenactor, there's a weird moment that you have to face and that's when inevitably somebody from the public at an event or a parade or something is going to thank you for your service because they think you're actually in the military for some reason. Now, if you're one of the many reenactors who's actually a veteran, then great, you just kind of say thank you and move on. But if you're not a veteran, like me, I make it very clear that I've never served in the military, it can be a little awkward. Which is crazy, because if there's one thing World War II reenactors are known for, it's not being awkward. I would normally guess that if somebody saw a person dressed like this walking down the street, they're not going to think, oh, that guy's clearly a military veteran. But sometimes you just run into somebody who doesn't know anything about the military, which there's nothing wrong with that. That's a lot of people fall into that category. They might just assume that since you're in a uniform, you're in the military. This has happened to me a couple times, and my general response is just to say something like, oh, that's very kind of you, but I don't deserve your thanks. I'm not actually a veteran or something like, oh, that's nice, but thank an actual veteran. I'm just a reenactor. Or at least that's what I'd like to think I say. Sometimes it just really catches me off guard and I go, I I'm, I'm not, I, and then I see that the person kind of understands and then they feel awkward. It's, it's just not good. Now, obviously, if you see an actual veteran, it's great to say thank you so they know you appreciate them. I'm not going to say that's never going to lead to an awkward situation, but it's definitely less awkward than saying thank you to somebody who wasn't actually in the military. Now, to be clear, a lot of people thank us just for being reenactors. They'll say like, oh, thanks for keeping the history of these guys alive. I'm talking about people who specifically say, oh, thanks so much for your service. So in conclusion, thank a veteran today, and if you see a reenactor, make sure to make them feel as awkward as possible.